the Toshotes, pays a lot of attention to what happens above its head, as its favorite prey usually are on the other side of the waterline. Sometimes a small and unwary insect falls into the water, and such an opportunity is not lost. There are few drowned insects, and competition is really high. There's so much pressure to feed that natural selection has performed another miracle in this unique fish. Its eyes can see what is happening outside the water. And most importantly, its brain can locate its prey exactly. It corrects the distortion of the images as the light crosses from air to water. Thus, the Toshotes jaculator, the archer fish, is able to locate faraway prey and catch them. This fish does not have any body extension, but it knows about ballistics. To shoot, the fish suddenly contracts its gills and sucks some water into its mouth. Then its tongue presses and squirts the water out at great speed. A thin groove in its palate turns the liquid into a short, precise, and deadly jet. By replacing water with air, man has hunted many of his best prey thanks to the blowpipe. These pipes work the same way as the Toshotes propelling system. A sudden tongue-aided blow projects and directs the dart. The blowpipe gives the predator a larger field of action so its prey do not feel threatened, and therefore do not try to escape. The prey is an immobile target, and nobody is a better marksman than the archer fish. This fish can reach a distance of up to a meter and a half. That's 25 times the length of its own body. Nobody in the Amazon jungle or Southeast Asia can perform a similar feat. But man has taken the Toshotes invention one step further. We have added poison to make it more deadly. But although human hunters apply many substances on their darts, the idea of a poisonous weapon is not human either.